Now it's after 24 hours. And I've got my solution here, my sodium uh, bicarbonate solution in a, oh, no, sorry, that is that, but I'm reading through and I've actually got my um, shell with the 250 milliliter beaker and I'm gonna decant that into a 50 milliliter beaker, which I need to get up to get. Um, I need another 25 milliliter beaker clean and dry. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna decant this. You can see I was really mashing it up with a fork here. I got rid of my spoon. Uh, I didn't wanna move it back and forth, so let's see. So I'm gonna decant this off as well as I can. Hmm, I just mashed it up. And it's got a lot of, well, it's gonna bring some of the brown dye with it because that seems to be floating on the top. Let's see what happens here. It's pretty icky actually. Hmm, I don't know how that's gonna work. Let's pour it back in there. And let's see if we can get the um, sodium bicarbonate solution into, yeah, that looks like it's working well. And I've only got five milliliters there, which is plenty. It says, um, doo -doo -doo. From the 100 milliliters into a quart, right, so that's this is the sodium bicarbonate, and then pour the solution. Let's see. So the 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 magic moment here is when you actually pour the egg um, into the the, the uh, calcium acetate solution into the sodium carbonate solution. The sodium bicarbonate, I mean, it looks good. This eggshell solution does not. So I'm gonna actually uh, pour it, well, yeah, I'm gonna pour it into this and let it settle out. Let's see if it does settle out. Ooh, that is a mess. That is a gelatinous mess. We're not going to be able to see anything from that. Let me see. Doesn't smell like vinegar anymore. Hmm. Well, uh, at least we've got our sodium bicarbonate ready. And let's stop for a minute while I figure this out.